so. Tenant Surge. Here's the team. Starting out with Gabby. Evolite. We got the Special D. Raise through the roof and HP. Pretty good base attack and speed anyway. Tough skin if they use contact moves, which I don't think they really do, but we're not a Sandstorm team. We're going to try to spam Bulldoze and Rock Slide on the bug. We can Dragon Claw if we want. Super effective Bulldoze will be 120 power. Dragon Claw will be 120 power with Stab. So they're about the same, but this slows. So not bad. We got Sally. Again, we're going to spam Bulldoze. Rock Slide on the bug. Ice Shard if something's low. And Spiky Shield if we want to scout. And we have the OP Ice Scales ability. So half special damage. And we're healthy in, in HP and uh, special D for our EVs. So like... Super, super tanky. Really good just base defense too, so even if there's an unexpected physical attack, you should be pretty good at tanking it. We got this berry, so fire attacks won't murder us, hopefully. Soft Sand Rufus, just good base attack. We we did uh, HP and specialty on him as well, just trying to live. Decent speed, Mold Breaker, so we can just Earthquake everybody. If we want to Rock Slide the bug instead of Earthquake, we can. But Rock Slide's not Stab. It would be super effective, so it'd be 150 power because it'd be super effective and it could flinch him, versus this is stab, so it'd be 150 power as well. So I think we just Earthquake everybody on Rufus, which is pretty sick. Um, we don't want to send out Rufus against Pinchurchin, right, because Pinchurchin would um, scald us. So what we could do is weakness policy. We could change his EVs to attack and speed. We could assume we're going to survive a Scald. We could weakness policy. And then as long as we didn't get burned, we'd be faster than everybody with two attack boosts and we could one-shot everybody. So that is a potential plan, but it's a lot more risky than this one, I think. But we could just have extra sweep the whole thing because he's OP with that strat. So that would be that'd be pretty good. could consider doing that, but I think we'll pass on this time. Sleep Powder and Rest don't work in the Surge, so we have to wait till the Surge is over. But we can spam Bulldoze, and then if we fight the bug, we can Draco. But we don't want to fight the bug, because we're a Grass type. Um, we got Harvest, so we can regain Consumed Berries. We got the Lumberry with the Rest combo. And it'll uh, help us if we get paralyzed for any reason. We got the King, Black Sludge, Sheer Force, Fire Punch for the bug, Bulldoze for everybody else. We got Coco, Fire Punch for the bug. Bulldoze for everybody else. We uh, we also have Thief we could use on Raichu, but I think Bulldoze will just... Prob well, no, Thief's probably better. They're both super effective, but Thief is stab. So I think we Thief, Raichu, we Fire Punch the bug. We have Bullet Punch in case um, we need to blast hit somebody quick. That's pretty good. Maybe Bulldoze to slow Raichu would be bad. But we got the Iron, Iron Fist for boosting punching moves. I couldn't get any other Dark moves. I think Thief's the only one I could get on him this point. We get crunch very, very soon. We'll have it for Morty, but it's the best I could do here. So I think we're ready. We could switch to that Exadrill strat, but I'm sure something would go wrong. Last minute switches aren't generally the best. But if we if we get wrecked, then uh, we should have done that strategy. Because as long as you don't get burned, I think you just one-shot everybody and win the fight. It seemed really easy if it worked. Okay. your chin. So that's like three to five turns of electric surge we gotta deal with. But if we have grounds out, then the surge doesn't really do anything. His defense is buffed, so he's gonna be really hard to kill. But I don't think he has any good moves to use against us. Bulldoze lowers his speed more. Dragon Claw does as much damage, but I think since um, Dragon Claw does as much damage as a super effective Bulldoze, he might switch to bug since we're ground. So I think Dragon Claw's a little bit better because it might uh it might switch. Okay. We're already faster, so Bulldoze doesn't help with that. It's gonna take quite a while to kill him. Okay, he does scald us, so burn's the only concern which happened. So it's really, really bad. Um so now our attack's like crippled too. We're really tanky, but the burn just sucks. So we're not gonna do any damage. It would be nice to kill him before we have to switch out, but we might not be able to. 
Ooh, we need crit. So first, first hit, burn. Second hit, crit. It's not good. This Gavite should be able to win this fight. It's just unfortunate that we got burned right away. So we go down from 60 to 30. So if he crits, we die. So I think we have to switch. Um, so who wants to eat a Scald? I guess it's probably Omelette, because it's double not very effective. We have the Lumberry as well. Not a huge fan of this. But I don't think... Yeah, we couldn't have put an item on to stop the burn, because we needed the Evolite. Crazy, dude. Two out of two burns. Okay, so now we get him with another Bulldoze. Maybe it'll, maybe it'll kill him? Probably not, though. At least we're wasting Electric Surge turns. Okay, one more will kill him, so hopefully he doesn't burn us on this last Scald. Oh, he discharges instead. Okay. That's still double not very effective, right? Maybe we should have led with Ex Executor. He did that much damage to me. Ooh, Harvest. We found the Lumberry back. OP. I think there's just a chance of that, but... Now, I think we Draco Hammer here in case he switches, because he might see that um, Surge is gone, like the Electric Surge, and he might switch. Okay. We don't want to not be able to hit the bug. Okay, so he's dead at least. Uh, our Dragon Ground is gone as well, pretty much, though. Okay, so we have to switch on this, because he's going to use a super effective bug attack. So who is good at tanking bug attacks? I think it might be double not very effective against Rufus, and Rufus has Earthquake. It's new. It's not very effective against Ray, too. Might be double not very effective, I'm not sure. I really want Ray to fire punch this, and Rufus is good against everybody. So I think we'll go with Ray, even though it seems about equal. I think a bug buzz won't hurt Ray very much. And I think a Fire Punch will wreck this bug. Ooh, we Volt Switch. That's surprising. It's even better, though. Uh, so he might Hard Switch, but we get a free Fire Punch if he does that, I guess. Because Bulldoze does nothing. And I don't really want to rock too much. Okay. Oh, he has a Fire Resist Berry. That's good to know. For the future. So this won't do that much, but the next one will kill him, probably, maybe? Oh, he has Energy Ball. Okay. That's neutral. That's fine, that's fine. The poison dual typing helps against everybody but Raichu in this fight. So the third fire punch will kill him. That's not terrible. Okay, he's roosting. That's kind of annoying. I think fire punch does about as much as his roost, and every time he roosts, we get to heal with black sludge. Uh, we could be rock tombing. No, I think we just gotta stick it out with a fire punch. We have no chance of burn because we're sheer force, though. But I think we just stick it out. He only has 10 roosts, so... I think it does about the, as much, so I don't think he's going to get to, like... Weave in, uh, weave in attacks. His first heals more than you take damage. You can weave in attacks, but... We just fire punch till he's out of roosts and then kill him. And we get to heal with full HP with our Black Sludge while this is going on. So I think that's fine. We'll just use up all his roosts and kill him anyway. Then he'll send out Raichu, and we'll have to hard switch. Probably do our dark type. Okay, there we go. He's out of roosts. And the bug's gone. Good job, El Ray. So here comes Raichu. We get a hard switch. Probably to our fighting type. Because he'll, uh, he'll use a psychic attack, like, certainly here. So then this is a free switch. If we switch to, like... Exadrill or Sally, they'll take a bit of damage, but it's not going to hurt them a lot. So they're decent switches as well. But I think the reason we bring Coco is for this fight in particular. Now Raichu might have some fairy attack that I'm not familiar with and wreck Coco. So that is a possibility, but we brought our dark Pokemon to fight Raichu. That's like the point, so we gotta try it. And then he could switch. I would like to Bulldoze to lower his speed, and it's better if he switches. But we might switch to Thief to do more damage. Luckily he didn't uh, Nasty Plot there, that would have been really bad for us. So I think we Bulldoze on this one, and we hope he doesn't have like a crazy good move. Okay, so we Volt switches. We get the Bulldoze off on Magnet Rike then, at least. That crit was annoying. 
So now we're gonna get intimidated once. If we if we can afford to stay in, we'll get intimidated twice. So this won't kill. And it won't even get him low enough that we can bullet punch to kill. But whoever we switch to is gonna get intimidated. Um, Rike has electric attacks. I don't think his electric attacks will hurt much more than Raichu's did. I think Raichu's pretty powerful on the damage side, so I think we'll survive a hit. I think we want to get a second Bulldoze in, weaken him, and then have somebody else come finish him off. I think is the play. We want him to transform so the Intimidate goes off on Panda Bear. We're just hoping that he doesn't have something that one-shots us here, but I don't think he does. I think it'll get us close to dying, though, so maybe we should have switched. Okay, so he Volt switches, and then we get to hit Raichu. So now he's going to intimidate us again when he comes back out, but we get a Bulldoze on Raichu. Which will lower its speed. But we got intimidated twice, so we didn't do as much damage as we were hoping. Now, I think Raichu probably still outspeeds us. So the, the play is we can Bulldoze. And then we get to hit Magnet Rike with a Bulldoze when it comes out. We could Thief if we think we're faster and it might kill. Or we could switch to a Ground type and then his uh, Bolt Switch fizzles, which is kind of sick. But I think it's better to Bulldoze because I think he's faster. So he'll Volt Switch. We'll go down pretty low but not die, I think. Hopefully I'm right on that map. Rike will come out and intimidate us, and then we'll switch. So then our next guy won't get intimidated, whereas if we switch now, our next guy will get intimidated. So I think that's the play. Yep, he's still faster even with one bulldoze, because Panda Bear's slow. We don't die. Even with a the crit there, I think we still live. We get the, the bulldoze off, we get the intimidate. So we're intimidated three times, so this isn't going to do that much. Okay, so then we switch. He's going to use an electric attack, so we want to switch to a ground. So that would be Rufus. And then Rufus can Earthquake twice and clean up the fight. So now he'll use his fire attack, and we just have to hope it doesn't one-shot us. I guess we could... We don't want to have you eat fire. Yeah. So we have to eat a fire attack, which kind of sucks, but I'm pretty sure Rufus can handle it. Oh, we're faster because of the, the uh, bulldoze. Sick. Exadrill's OP. Yeah, I think you could just stack Exadrill with speed and attack and have him one-shot everything in this fight. And I don't think Raichu has a move to use against us. It's probably faster because we didn't bulldoze it, but I don't think it has anything that'll one-shot us. That's not very effective. That's pretty bad if that's his best move against us, right? It does do physical damage and we teched for special, so it did do something, but... The good stuff. Okay, so Surge defeated, nobody lost. Good stuff. We had a really good uh, amount of ground Pokemon for this fight. 